So how do we? Get I don't know. The light said to come back. Symbol said to come back in here. There's also a weird floaty pixely thing outside, so maybe I should go check that out. Yeah, probably. It's weird that there's a waypoint in here. Unless I'm missing something. Well, the waypoint's pointing to the top of the tower. Oh. So it wants you to get to the top, but I don't that know. That could be it. I don't know how you get there. Maybe I'll go to this thing over here and that'll tell me things. Let's learn things, Andrew. Let's go to the dead end over here. Oh, wait, that doesn't... Wait, is, yeah. that, a, is that a solved... Is that the symbol of a solved tentacle? What? In front yeah. of me. Yes. Oh, so that's a collectible you already got. Yes. That's not anything. Okay. Nope. Never mind. Oh, that I, what you thought was yeah, uh, trying thought, to tell you? No. Thought, I'm like, oh, that's a weird thing on the map. Oh, maybe there it I, is. Maybe I go there. No. Is that that rope? There's a rope dangling down. Look um, to the left. That. That could be it. It looks like it's dangling. Oh, yeah. That's probably low enough. Yeah. First person running. So exciting. Oh. Uh, it's really disheartening when you're playing this game and like you're looking for the roots and you drive past the... You have to drive through the location that it makes you during during the bat fight. Oh. And they even still have the buildings fall like falling over. Yeah. So you're just so kind of... So it's just like debris and nonsense yeah. trying to get through it. What? How Wait. Do you... I look my stick. Oh, there it is. <laughs> so how do you get up there? Probably go down here and climb up or something. Oh, you probably jump there on a ledge. Whole, there was this whole place down here. <laughs> this doesn't seem right. <laughs> okay. Good hustle, bro. Or, or maybe it's you have to go up Let's to go the back. top area and then jump over the fence or something. Did you get yourself stuck? I sure did, it Tom. Happens, Tom. Happens a lot. Yeah. Play tested is what this game is. Definitely play tested. Play tested was probably the middle name of this game. Yeah. Similar to how Sonic's middle name is the. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it sounds stupid when you think about it because it didn't happen. Maybe I climb up there. No. Why not? Because it's the light. Oh, you mean climb that ledge? No, jump up. Okay. Uh, okay. Can you jump over the fence? No. No. Maybe I can. Can what? You, wait, can you, you can't move objects that are big enough to stand on this game, can you? What? Okay. The that's, fuck? That did not necessarily seem intentional, but I'll take it. <laughs> Do you think that was intentional at Play all? Playtested is the name of this game. I just stood on... Oh, oops. you broke bottles. That looked like it was going to blow up on me. Yeah, I think you're not supposed to stand on those, considering how many people in real life get impaled by those. So I, f I feel like I did that wrong, but I'm not... So oh, I, the game... I guess, I guess I was supposed to jump down... Oh, that makes more sense. Yeah. yeah, jumping down. We saw we saw it pointing down here, so we just figured, oh, it will go around down there. But we're probably supposed to jump down. But that was fuck that noise. Apparently, uh, jokes on you. Oh, by the way, uh, okay. the most useless thing possible is like you put a you put a. Uh, Why are you not climbing? <laughs> you put a what's it called? Um, put a water bottle. You put a light. Uh, put a glow stick in a water bottle. Yeah, and then you. Uh, oh, a glow stick in a water bottle. That sounds neat, actually. Yeah, and then you're- it's something else you're supposed to do. Like, oh, and I think you tape a- like, you tape glow sticks to <laughs> it. And then- it's, it's, that was weird. <laughs> that was an animation. Oh, by the way, uh... How are things going, Edward? Fine. It's a wonderful night for the end of the world. What? Listen, I've been reading Theo's notes, and it seems that the person who reaches the end of the path of light We'll have to make a critical choice concerning the fate of humanity. It's not clear, but it seems that by choosing, this person will are call you, the Lightbringer to are Earth. Are you standing on the ground? And as we've discussed earlier, that might not be such a great idea. Will it save us or destroy us? It doesn't say. This is crazy, Edward. Once again... She... He... <laughs> First of all, he just hung up oh! on her ass. Oh shit! Oh, it's a kunai guy. Shit! I love this guy. So he just hung up on her ass. What? All, all of a sudden, basically. Ah, shit! I'm dying, aren't I? Yes. Shit. Do I even have heals? Nope. You have no shit. healing items. Um, could like to get behind cover. Wee! But he just hung up on her ass without saying goodbye or anything. But also, yes. she called to say nothing. <laughs> yes, she called to say nothing. She, she said nothing in that phone call. Die. Just fall over. They still fall over, right? Don't they? I don't know if these ones do. Let's test it. Ow. I tested it by dying. So, uh, she's- but mostly I was amazed by the fact that she called and just was like, It doesn't say! It doesn't say! And I'm like, this, this phone call's accomplishing nothing. 
Oh my god, we have to do the cutscene again. Press B to pick up. Also, it'll pick up anyway, apparently. <laughs> oh, did you not press it? No. Wait, what is that on the like, Why was there a press back to pick up in the first place? Oh, it's a light. Okay. Wow, so I get to listen to this shitty conversation every single time. Yes. Wow. I better- I better- did I- did I pre-craft Molotovs? Uh, you just throw bottles and shoot them and they'll blow up in the Molotovs. You don't even need to make a rag going That's only if you're gonna light it on fire. You can it. literally just throw the, the yeah. bottle at them and shoot it. Yeah. Wait, do I- I don't have bullets. You have enough bullets. I used all five of my bullets. No, just reload. You have more bullets. What? Yeah. Ow. Just go to the hotkey and- or just the- uh, Fucking- <laughs> Yeah, so you have more bullets. There you go. Yeah. Just- Do I have more bullets? Yeah, right, right, right. Right. So just reload your gun and then, uh... There you D go. Does he not fight? Is this actually a pause menu? Yes. Oh. Doesn't sound like a pause menu. I'm dead. I think. <laughs> just run behind cover. Bring out the bottle. Uh, don't shoot it when you're close by because it'll kill you. So, no, no, no too close. <laughs> Wee! Ow. Okay. Please don't be dead. Okay. I mean... Oh, God, this is so much fun! <laughs> we get to watch the cutscene again! You know what would have been easier? If the game didn't fuck you and, like, get rid of the item I prepared if, for you. Yeah, or if any of this stuff handled well, Fine. so I could just use the item already. Yeah, so I guess just quickly hotkey B, B again to reload. Yeah. Or X to reload? I can't remember which one. Oh god, unskippable cutscenes in this game. Yeah. Why? Reminds me of the guy who gets eaten. Over and over and <laughs> the over. The guy getting eaten. That was one of the first times in this playthrough I had to actually edit it. So I'm like, we can't show all these. We can't show how long we were stuck in this damn dark hallway make, trying to make the stupid mechanic work. This just nasty, dank hallway yeah. with this nasty, dank blob. There was a whole part where you like are making up mechanics that don't exist about what we need to do. I'll throw it. Oopsie. Did I Good kill enough. him? Yeah. Cool. Oh, no, it didn't. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, no, not not you. That here? Yes. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's too close. Killed the shit out of myself. And not him, specifically. Yeah, because he has three. <laughs> he has three marks on him. He has two in the front, one in the back. Yeah. Can, uh, can I just not? How are things going, Edward? God. So how does this make it onto the disc? How did somebody not go like, hey, Bob, you know what's really terrible is when you have to sit through a cutscene three times because you accidentally blew yourself up. Who makes a cutscene that's immediately followed by getting attacked by a guy in close quarters that's meant to try to kill you? That's the whole point of enemies? Yeah. But then if you die, you watch the same cutscene over and over again. Wh that says nothing, by the way. Never says anything. Oh, wow. The end of this big game is going to end in a choice, maybe. And what's, Whoa. The, what's the choice, Keith? What, what a the revelation. Choice be? What do you think it is? I don't know. Fucking suicide or not? <laughs> Got it. Oh my god, are you serious? I bet you the choice is god damn it. kill yourself, save humanity, or save yourself, kill humanity. That'd be stupid. What would it be? Yeah. It's alone in the dark. Nothing is stupid. Is he dead now? Is he yeah, dead for real? Yes. Okay, cool. So see, you don't have to put the Yeah. Yeah, wow. Put, so we went the entire game making well, Molotovs for no reason. Yeah, because I mean if you Sweet. I, I the only reason I figured that out was I thought about it critically and I said yeah. putting the rag in the bottle doesn't make the bottle explode. Yeah. So, like, clearly I don't have to do that, right? We were just doing it because it seems like in the video game... Because it tells you. Yeah. It tells you to make a Molotov, you have to combine a, a the thing. The game teaches you how to make, like, half the things in the game and doesn't tell you when to use them. Yeah. And so you just assume that's how the items work. Like, you assume, oh, you put a rag in a thing to make it count in the game as a Molotov, otherwise it's a bottle of bullshit. Yeah. But no, you just shoot bottles. No, apparently the Great. bottle's explosive. Cool. It's this game has no concept of how to do anything regarding conveyance of but mechanics. But you need to play it. Everybody needs to play it, guys. <laughs> that guy was so I, fucking proud of his product. I can't stress this enough. Oh, how, it's so oh, worrying. Oh, you burnt the handle of the fucking... I, I mean, I didn't burn... Oh, yeah, I probably did. <laughs> yeah, it's not even... <laughs> oh, it reignited. Why, why would you program that? Like that? Yeah, why is it flammable? It's, it's pretty. There's a, there's an irony to that. The freaking a fire axe. A is fire flammable. axe's handle uh, being burned away. Like, wh what is your god now? Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Yes. Exciting what you messages that don't want? give us information that are in that's interesting. Wee. Two of them. Woohoo. Is this the one we had last time? Uh. No. Have fun. 
Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, the last one had air quotes. So yeah. <laughs> is that what you're looking for? Yep, that was what I was looking for. <laughs> the Philosopher's Stone was Lucifer's invention to seduce men. Wasn't that the apple? He nurtured the myth over centuries by influencing the most important alchemists. What? The apple was the serpent. Did the serpent have anything to do with Lucifer? Uh, it depends on how deep you are into mythology and the Christian Bible. I don't know. Uh, if you want to talk about pre-creation of Lucifer, then no. The, the serpent wasn't Lucifer. The serpent was just an entity. Then again, weren't the Adam and Eve and the, and the apple not even in the Bible? Uh, no, those were in the Bible, but the serpent wasn't uh, Satan. The serpent was just a bad guy. Um, a bad sim- guy. <laughs> yeah, sim- similar to uh, similar to how uh, like because like it's similar to how this thing of like remember the in the story where they talk they tell you to put like sheep's blood on the door so the fucking giant monster doesn't attack people. Probably Wasn't don't remember that, that. The Old Testament. That was the Old Testament. Yeah, but that's, that was that's Moses. But that was also not Satan. Or is that the Moses story? That's but the Moses story. They're gonna yeah. steal your 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 sons. If they you steal your put... first burn. Fourth yeah. burn. That first burns. First burns. <laughs> first burns. <laughs> they're gonna steal your first burns. <laughs> <laughs> I would read I would read a Bible if it talked like that. <laughs> Moses said, and my fish burns. Everybody saved their fish burns, put the blood into sheep and the dirt. <laughs> uh, in any case, yes, yeah, so uh And Jesus said you were still don't need the volcano to water <laughs> and need a rich man to give or something for the fuck quote. <laughs> Welcome to City Pass. City Pass <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. Uh, any case, I gotta keep reading this. Do you remember that earlier part where she t- took this two words and they, they sounded like things? So it was like a pun for Lucifer, and it's like, Lucifer is behind this! Yeah, yes! Because <laughs> that happened in this game. Uh, don't. <laughs> this you... guy named Ferguson liked I Love Lucy. It's Lucifer! <laughs> That's the plot of this game, more or less. God. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> that's what we're doing with uh, our lives. Uh, any case, where was I? <laughs> All right, talking about influencing the most important alchemist, like that guy who brewed piss, trying to make gold. <laughs> like I remember that guy, so influential. Did it say that on the screen? No. Oh, oh my but, God, it said, right. but it said influ- influencing the most important alchemist, and the only alchemist mm-hmm. I know is a guy who like bottled urine and brew it to make gold and discovered methane <laughs> or like discovered uh, was it like I can't remember what he discovered he discovered like some bad fucking chemical <laughs> it was like I like, don't know much about alchemy yeah. history I, <laughs> I don't know much alchemy like scientists and artists people need to believe in it the poor dreamt of fortune and the rich of eternal life many things were built and destroyed because of this myth By giving the stone this magical aura, Lucifer was sure it would never be destroyed. It's one hell of an enemy we found here. Yeah, get it? Hell of an enemy? Yeah, get it? Because we're talking about Lucifer. The most ancient and the most furious of them all. There's a war coming. I just want to call him Louie for the rest of the game. Louie? Yeah. This whole oh, game. now it's we, another we, we, one? This whole thing could be, like, resubtitled as Alone in the Dark, Life with Louie. <laughs> I'm scared and feeling down again. <laughs> <laughs> Here I go again on my own. Come on to the professor of Futurama. <laughs> I made myself sad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still not making much progress. I can't find the connection between the path of light and the afterlife. Is that supposed to be one word? I thought afterlife was one word. He's old. He forgot. (laughs) I thought he should. (laughs) The university cut my budget in half. And anyway, the stone is missing. Where the hell can Edward be? Ever since that incident in Prague, I have a bad feeling tightening in my guts. This game's a sequel to Deus Ex Mankind yeah. Divided. Why always in Prague? Prague? Well, Prague why? shows up a lot. Yeah, why always games. Prague, man? Prague gets a bad rap. That's a weirdly specific thing, and it's always yeah, it's always the end of the world or racism <laughs> or something. <Yeah. laughs> why Prague? What is, that, did you... is that like Venice, where it's like, oh, the Renaissance, and maybe some murders, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe some the, Assass- the Assassin's Creed plot. <laughs> is that like the tourism guy to view Venice? Is like, come to I mean, Venice, art, culture. Maybe some murders. <laughs> like, uh, it's an elevator. Wow, that what is what kind of elevator? A magic. 
That is the worst telescope I have ever seen. It is pointing at a brick wall. <laughs> Why? <laughs> what has become of us? But also, like, this thing doesn't have a mechanism. It's just magic. Like, fuck it. Yes. <laughs> fuck it at this point. It's, things are just magic it's now. It's magic heat. So, but oh, uh, what? What? How is it going into the... It's a, it's a brick wall. It's a brick How wall. How did that move? I don't... Is this Beetlejuice rules? Do they draw on chalk in a circle and opens a portal to hell? Like, what the fuck? What are you going to even <laughs> see? The other side of Central Park? This wasn't even acceptable movement in, like, a Resident Evil game on the P PS1. <laughs> to have, like, something move that way? <laughs> Unbelievable as a real... Oh. I see. But you gotta look at the moon, okay. sucker. Is look it, at the is, moon! Is it the moon? Oh my god. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that! I guessed it! <laughs> yes! Yes! It was the moon! Oh! Oh my god! Oh, that's so good! And it's over! Oh, that's so good! I cannot believe you would literally do that. Why? Why would you think- So you suggested that ironically, didn't you? Yes! Because it would be so dumb if it was the moon! Because it's just a fucking moon and it doesn't point to anything! It's just a dumb asteroid in the fucking space that collided with no, us on accident! No, it's all part of Lucifer's planet, it Drew. It doesn't even fucking control it's, the moon! It's Satan's butthole is the moon in the sky. <laughs> Earth, there's no way it could like be a symbol to point to something. <laughs> I like the rolls credits, and then it just comes back to us being right here. And it... why is it in Central Park specifically? Wait, the moon only Wait, works Andrew, in Central Park. I, I hit continue. I'm still here. Well, yeah. Where else are you gonna go? Well, every every other chapter is like previously on. Then you just you start the next level. <laughs> Wait, where is it even pointing to? Uh, that spot. What a house on the hill. That's never happened before, though. You hit continue at the end of a chapter, and it's like, eh, whatever. You're here now. I mean... It's because the beginning and the ending of 7 and 8 are the same free-roaming level, yeah. right? Yeah. That's weird, though. That to it really it further highlights just how this off. is just a total departure of the rest of the campaign. It's not gonna hurt you. That sounds like a bad plan. I- that's how I got out of we here. Uh, oh, uh. I, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's- I didn't know how to get down from the tower, because I've never been here, but the chapter 8 starts you here, so I just jumped off. I was like, fuck it! By the way, the painting's gone. It disappeared. Well, like, it burnt. Just like the magic. fire. The, even though the blob's nothing, probably gone, too. Even though there's nothing to burn- Yeah, the blob's gone. There's nothing to burn, because this whole room- this whole thing's a, a brick st structure? Yes. Although we've established that those bricks can apparently be automated to f fold in through each other... ...somehow. Also, who set the <laughs> fire in this place? Yeah, who's who's lighting brick churches on fire? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Lucifer. Lucifer. Oh, That's okay. Life with Louis. So, so let's do this. Um, we're gonna go. We're gonna take a slight detour. We're gonna go on a on a um, vacation for well, supplies. Well, here, here's why. So press press uh, back on the on the screen. What's up? Go to your map. I've never been here before. Welcome. Go to the right. Welcome yeah. To your destination at the very end of the map. Hi. So, uh, before we go and take that long, very fun drive... This is a really big open world they use for none of the levels. <laughs> and look at all those spots I had to go to. Yeah. Oh! Look, like that one in the middle of the lake you can't drive a car to? You can't drive a car there? No, because you have to climb stairs and the game won't let you try climb stairs with a car. Is, unless there, you... is there monsters there? Oh, yeah. Yay. And you've got to walk for a long time. That, that does look like a long walk. It's a long walk. Oh, my God. That's like the, that's like the width of the map. That and bridge. I had to go from the other end, too, to get that other one all the way at the end of it. <laughs> it was fun. So go ahead and uh, get in the first car you're about to run into. Okay. Um, And we're going to drive a little... We're going to drive we're straight. Going? So see that car that's right in front of you? Yeah. Get onto the main road and then just keep driving straight. This way or that way? Uh, right. Right? Yeah, drive that way. Am I just going towards my destination uh, or am no. I trying to get something? Uh, you're just going to try to get something. Okay, but the, it's up there on that yes. weird cliff place. It always spawns there. Sweet. Okay, so city is it cars... The, is, it the is it a special gun? Um, oh, the, oh, that's police car. Okay, so police cars are always uh, are always yellow wires. They're always yellow wires? To hot wire. So you... Fit, you <laughs> yes. Oh my god, you've played this so much now that you know... Yeah. Oh, also, uh, uh, cop cars always have ga uh, ammo and batteries in them. In so the glove compartment. Is that consistent? Yes. That's weird. Ammo and batteries. There you go. Whoa. Um... 
It's like you, you're the person who can see through the Matrix now, and yeah, you can see like blonde, brunette, redhead. It's uh, also, <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you this, is all caps start with blue cables, and they always have health items in them. Oops. Too far. See? <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck, Andrew? <laughs> I told you. I'm, I'm so like, sorry. I'm really good at this game now. I'm so sorry. I mean, so, I'm not sorry because I got to just come back and not do any of it. Yeah. But I'm like hypothetically sorry. Oh shit. Oh, by the way, uh, I have that vague feeling of knowing that I should feel sorry, but I'm not actually sorry. The, yeah. So <laughs> you're running into the problem now. So curbs are raised just enough that you that have to hit. That they're to drive. Yeah, you have to hit them straight. It's easier to get on the other side. It is. Oh yeah, because you know the whole map too. Yes. <laughs> I'm really worried about you now. I'm, I'm taking you to a, des a, des a pre-loaded destination that has yeah. items that we need. Guess what? Six months. <laughs> How many more months until we're done? <laughs> the alchemists agree on the fact that the stone has the power to keep a carrier alive eternally. That's why I still have hope for Edward. On the other hand, I know what kind of suffering he must be enduring. The aura of the stone is a true plague. I don't know what Edward will look like if we meet again one day. I feel sad. He didn't deserve this. I should have made the sacrifice. I gotta say, there's now like a pantheon of three different narratives that involve an alchemist and a philosopher's stone in my head. And this one does not stand up to the other two. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> my god. If you compare this to Full Metal Alchemist, you just, you're yeah. just insulting Full Metal Alchemist. Yeah, Full Metal Alchemist and the first Harry Potter movie. So you want to... Turn right. The oh, okay. So stop, stone, stop, stop, stop. Here it is. Which we renamed so the Sorcerer Stone in we America because they thought that Americans were stupid. So you know here's an ambulance. Oh yeah. So press like, B we to can't get call out. it the Philosopher's Stone. No one knows what it is. It's the Sorcerer Stone because wizards. wizards. <laughs> Even though they call it the they call it the freaking Philosopher Stone for the entire the, the game the entire book. Yeah. <laughs> it's never called that in the book. It's just okay. on the box. So go so ahead. So these are the blood packs we've heard about. This yeah. Is the first time I'm seeing them, are isn't it? Uh, yes. I found a lot of you them. You can stab exploring. them with a knife. We don't have. Yes, we don't have a knife. It doesn't come pretty with a knife either. Like yeah. it doesn't spawn you with a knife. So I don't and, know where you get it, and I don't know how. And if and without it, do these do anything? Uh, no, they're just blood packs. Uh, actually, try picking that, one up and throwing it. And see. Ooh, bandage. Yeah, bandages. There's bandages. Bandage. Uh, Band yeah. You need to remove. I have to get uh, rid of bullshit. Batteries. Lighter. Too many batteries. Oh my god, I have batteries for D's. Yeah, so drop that. Uh, the bandages aren't much. I think it's like two. Ammo for all the guns. That's not how any ammo works. <laughs> uh, it had to because if it spawns you with a nine millimeter, the video you're game's universal ammo. Yeah. <laughs> So go ahead and drop the lot of shots? drop the thing. Whoa! Yeah. Oh, th that's three boxes. Jeez. Yeah. So go ahead and drop the uh, glow stick. This glow stick. Yeah. Just drop it. Oops. What if I combine it with my gun? You can combine it with your uh, with a bottle. Can I? Yeah. Whee! There you go. Now it's attached. <laughs> that um, sounds like fun. So I should throw a glowy bottle at somebody that explodes. So go ahead and grab bandages. the bandages, Hit. which are only one. I really think. wish that this game had the. Uh, Elder Scrolls Fallout thing of aim at thing to pick it up. Yeah, instead of and so pick up the spray can. Well, I guess it kind of does that. And then pick up the on the other side. There's a healing can, which you can use to heal yourself. Hello. There you go. Okay. All so right. uh, so we have spray can, two explosive bottles, and a healing can. Yeah. We've got bandages. One bandages yeah. One. It's just one. Oh man. But we know. But we now we know we don't have to use them for lighters. So yes. at least it's so we can save it for emergencies. Now. Uh. Ammo, batteries, we're good. This are this is a good mix of. Th I mean, you can't. Yeah. I feel like we don't have enough stuff, but you're, that's really about all you can do besides stacking stuff more, because the yeah. game has no inventory. Pretty much. Um. So, uh, now you're gonna take the car. So uh, we were here just for the ambulance. Yes, or? we were here for the ambulance because it had. Uh, it always spawns those goods. So we need to. <laughs> you're under arrest. I'm glad you can get into the back because that <laughs> never is a feature that's useful. So go ahead and. It literally uh, has no purpose in this game. Yeah. You can't find loot in the back row, nope. and no one ever drives you anywhere. So go ahead and stop. Uh, you're, gonna, like, you're not going to like throw. Oh, stop. You're going to like get pulled over and like sneak into the back row. Like, it wasn't me, officer. I wasn't driving. I guess he took off over there. <laughs> uh, so go ahead and pause and go to the map. All right. Um, all right. This is what we're going to have to do. Sup. All right. So go to the left. The left is the edge of the screen. You mean you the mean west? Le uh, yeah, west. Okay. Just, uh, I was gonna no, say go, my uh, I was gonna uh, say my left is my left is the edge of the map. <laughs> yeah. So uh, sorry. Go to uh, so go to the west again. Yeah. So we need to get to here. 
He's pointing at the bottom left. Yeah. Ish. Okay, what are we going for now? Uh, to, we're gonna go get our uh, 44, we're, our uh, 44 Magnum. Staring down the barrel of a 44. Uh, because we're gonna need it for the boss. That's not what that song says. Because <laughs> uh, the boss fight's gonna require us to shoot it, and uh, I don't want to shoot it with eight bullets. I'd rather what? shoot. Yes. <laughs> um, just like GTA. I'm dying now. My oh, screen is gray. You want to know what's great <laughs> is you cannot destroy light poles, but you can destroy benches. What? Sure. Metal, like the concrete benches. Oh. Like the ones that are concrete with the wood oh. on top. Yeah, you can destroy those. Well, goody. Oh, navigating this place is a funny yeah, time. Yeah, there's cracks so, yeah, everywhere. You need to take the main road. You have to be on that main road which, or else. Which is shockingly hard to get onto. Yes. Because you can't just drive at it half the time. Hello, tree. Nothing's destructible and also most slopes stop your car dead. As somebody who's driven off-road in a freaking Civic before, which is not meant for that... Uh, it still handles not, a lot better than this. Not that fucking hard, honestly. See why I couldn't get to the water thing? It can't do stairs. Stairs are great. It's not that fucking hard to drive off-road in, in small sloping grass oh. fields. Oh, never mind. We don't need to do that. Oh, actually, stop. Um, What's up? Go back to that cab. Um, you want me to get in the cab I just passed? Uh, no. Go ahead and heal yourself. Because you need to heal. And while you're at it, stop, go in the ga cab, grab the healing item that it has oh. inside of it, and then that way you can reset your healing item. So there's gonna be a healing spray in that? Yeah, there's always healing spray in the cab. Uh, okay. Because it'll probably- This probably... is the authentic alone in the dark experience. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's so exciting, and I'm terrified, and constantly under attack, by the way. Like, I'm so vulnerable in this open area. I'm- it's really like I'm gonna have nightmares about this experience. That's why. Okay, yeah. So go I'm, ahead and go get. I'm gonna the have so much nightmares about this uh, thing where I'm just walking around a fucking empty world doing nothing. Oh, there's plenty of enemies, and man, <laughs> when they magnetized your car, they magnetized. Oh yeah, the, the, the way they, they magically jump at your car from, I, from I 50 drove, yards away. I ran into a guy, and then I drove all the way down to the like. Probably I like how his a lights good, are still on, by the way. Yeah. I probably drove like a good, maybe like 200 feet. He's still magnetizing my car. It just took him a <laughs> he while. He just flew across yeah, the map. Like, to the point where like I, I paused, I got out of my car, and so, then he... You know what he did magnetized. there? That's just another reason why this game is Sonic. Yeah. That's the Sonic and Shadow fight where they magically fly at you for across the entire map and, yep. and, and eventually catch up with you with their air dash. It's... <laughs> Fuck this game. Game of the year. What if this game had a game of the year edition? I would I would turn into donkey immediately. Have you seen the games that have game of the year editions? Like I could see it happening. I don't I don't think so. Fucking is this right or the other was right? Yeah, that's this that's fine. Right. Either okay. way is fine. Cause cause uh fucking two worlds, yeah. <laughs> I still I, as somebody fucking who fucking two worlds, what the I, fuck? I, I beat I beat two worlds one. God. Yeah, it's a... Uh, no. That is firmly, at best, a I'm listening to podcasts and vaguely paying attention to what buttons I'm pressing game. <laughs> it is not. So, take the left. it looks like yeah. a game from 2001, but it came out on 360 in like 2007 or something. Oh no, sorry, take the right. Take your right. And so, then they made a sequel that also no one cared about. It's so hard to tell because the fucking map's too I'm, tiny. I'm and you can't how many out. franchises some of the RPG, RPGs get. Was it like a... It was Avernum, not, not sorry, not Avernum. That's a CRPG, but a uh, Risen. Oh, and Risen, yeah. Two Worlds, Two Worlds, and uh, what's the other one that I'm always surprised keeps getting sequels? Is uh, Arcania or something? Ar yeah, Arcania, I think. Or Arcania Four had a subtitle that was bigger than the main title, and oh. it looks like the real title. It's like that one has like four in its series. So like, wow, it's, yeah, dude. you turn down the street. So it's oh yeah, it was the one glowy purple, one orange spot, right? Yeah, the orange yeah. spot. Yep, one orange. spot. And admittedly, spot. I haven't played most of those games, so who knows? Maybe they're okay. <clears throat> I played a uh, I played Divinity, uh, Ego Draconis. And I'm like, this seems like an incredibly low quality product, but then Original Sin happened, so I guess those people can make decent games. So that was a surprise. <laughs> So maybe those companies have hope one day, I don't know. No, probably not. Hello, corpse. <laughs> <laughs> Literally nothing on it. Yeah, and it's also just... no, like, gore or, like, they sign of death. So just, just go just to the building right here. You're gonna go inside of it. This building? Uh, yeah. So just, uh, ha -ha! no, uh, other direction. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Other way. Die, heroic jump. Yeah, and then just, oh, well. 
Ha ha! <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> Looks legit. Camera hey. change. Uh. It just wants uh, to make sure you understand that there are things in here you need. Once you notice the one reason this building exists <laughs> yes. at all costs. Is that, yep. another, is that a healing thing? No, that's another uh, spray can. Oh. Well, better gun. Yep. There we go. So we got our gun if back. You, if you want to... Which we had last time we played it, right? But it overrode it because yes. the game's a dick. Yeah, but I also got it before I saved the yeah, game again. Yeah, and then it just replaces you with sh your guns with shitty guns. Yeah. For reasons. So, uh, if you want to, you can throw away one of the bottles. Uh, if you want to. And get another spray can. And just get another spray can. Yeah. Because you're going to be using spray cans all the damn time. I mean, this one's clearly less uh, less amazing because it doesn't have a glow stick on it. Yes. So. It also has lower numbers. I guess that also <laughs> specifies a bit. All right. Spray can. Come yeah. to me. So uh, there you Aha. go. Aha. Oh. <laughs> yep. So there There's you go. some game where you pick up stuff with X, apparently, and I defaulted <laughs> to that in my head. <laughs> so you should be good to go now. Uh, you should be able to take anything that comes parkour, your way. Parkour, parkour. I don't even think you can get up there. Parkour. Oh my god. Parkour. You're not supposed to do that. Parkour. You're really breaking it, Keith. <laughs> you can't crouch in this game, can you? No. <laughs> I was gonna crouch and try to go under it. Alright, well, back to our boring taxi. Yep. I mean, cop car. Cop car. But so back exciting. To, back to getting back to the end of the map. Yay!